Everybody, welcome back to Half-Life. Boxes. In this episode, we get to satisfy our OCD and kill all the fucking boxes. Every single one of them is dead. I wonder what's in one of these things. Oh, I, would, I won't be able to tell. Alright. Well, let's just uh, kind of go up here. Uh, that's not good. Uh, this is just go time for a little swim. So why are we putting like fucking body parts into our water supply? Confined space. Oh, that's that's unfortunate. Well, there's a maintenance access there. And there's a nice fan there. All right, well, let's go into the uh, really disgusting looking water. Now we don't actually have to go through that thing. I don't think you'd be able to anyway, so it would crush you. Oh, I think I'll skip a whole lot of this stuff, actually. I don't see ammunition there. Uh, here's another crushinator. But we can, ac we can actually swim under that one. And, oh, hey! It brings us all the way out here. Now we can go right back here if we wanted to. But we don't want to, because it's lame here. This water felt- this water kind of smells funny anyways. Okay, apparently I can't, uh, go up yet. We'll go over here. Apparently, I have the, I have a silencer on my crowbar right now. Oh, there we go. I took it. I took it off. All right. Well, we can stop these crushes if we want to. That makes things really easy. And we can also just go right back out here if we want to. Oh, man. Everything just leads back to the same fucking place. Oh, wait. It only it only stops for a second, this thing. Oh. Oh, I just destroyed... The, I just totaled the entire fucking thing. So, some of them are going backwards, so I, I need to make them all go forwards. Oh, and also that thing's shooting at me. So they're all going forwards now. There we go. All right, let's let's go. Let's go. Conveyor belt time. Love conveyor belts. Or maybe I don't. Gordon doesn't like to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. Oh god. What have I done? Oh, that was pointless. This is the pointless uh, conveyor belt room. Oh fuck. What purpose does this machinery serve? I think Breen is just having a bit too much fun with the uh, machinery here. I mean, he, he ordered all this fucking stuff. Let's go in the green goo. Oh, there's absolutely nothing in the green goo. We gotta go over there. I'm just- I'm trying not to go out anywhere where I'll just fall off- fall the fuck off. Alright. What's this way? I'm just kinda curious to see what's this way, you know? Oh, uh, this is just another conveyor belt. We are totally going in whatever fucking direction we- we please. I don't have a lot of ammo for this- this shit. I should really be careful. Oh, fuck me. Oh, fuck me. Oh, God. No. No, no, no. No, no. Alright, we gotta just deal with it. We weren't really given a choice. I think we just skipped over a whole lot of that other section, though. I didn't really want to, but... I, I kinda was curious to see if I could go back- Oh, fuck. Okay, now we do that entire part again. Oh, we can actually go back this way. Ah! Hello.
I mean, we haven't been down here, have we? To the stairs here. Stairs. Stairs. I'm just kind of, kind of curious. Ah, see, look, there is a hell station here, so there was kind of a point. I've never actually seen the stairs here, because I usually never fall off. Or when I do, I just qu kind of quick load up. But the game does actually have, like, a mechanism for you to get back there if you really want to. So you're supposed to just jump on that, and then you're done. And use that machinery. However, we already have a door open, so there's no point in us going through the entire section again. Even though I kind of skipped past a lot... Well, can you really call it skipping past a lot of it? Because I kind of just... I, I, I did what I was supposed to. I, I navigated through it. I just got really lucky with the direction I chose. Because usually you, you just follow the conveyor belts to places. And I have no idea where the fuck I'm going. I'm just saying. Is it really the wrong way when you're going the right way? Alright. Oh, hey. Questionable ethics. Oh, that was one way of dealing with them all. I just decided fuck that. Oh, we also solved the puzzle somehow. We we're I think we were supposed to shoot that or something, but the explosion just, just completely fuckled on everything here in this room. So... So I kind of decided that was a uh, that was a way I could use expend le way less health in that in that entire section. Damn, you're ugly. It was it was I need to kill it because it was ugly. I don't have a lot of weapons for, uh... Wow, I don't have a lot of weapons, period. Holy shit balls! Huh, now I get to do some science. Look at all these headcrabs. Well, let's go science the fuck out of them. This is... This is my idea of science. Residence Cascade, etc. Interesting. When I press that button, uh, uh, headcrabs explode. That will be my thesis. This is this is why I'm I'm the theoretical physicist, and you're the dead guy. Uh, this guy's a lot of this guy had a lot of bullets or grenades. Now in in S Ven Co-op, uh, when you play this in co-op, you can lock your friend out here, and then just like and you can press this as many times as you want. You can just keep locking people out here, and there's nothing they can do. They just fucking die. Hey, it's no good up there. It's all sealed off. The only way out would be to find someone with scanner access who can open the front door. I'm pretty sure there's a few scientists hiding somewhere in the labs. Maybe with both of us looking, we can track them down and get them to let us out. See, why was there a soldier there? Like, are you working with them? That. Let's run like, hell. like, how did you not see him and stop him? Like, or, like, do your security guard stuff? They don't really seem to pick up on the noise that I make when I when I fire grenades and shit. Which is quite unfortunate for them. I only have two bullets left. Oh, there's nothing else like here. Oh, there's ATV suit with blood on it. 
I like how this is like a, a, a gas pump, you know? Alright, well, let's see. We can't get outside. It's unfortunate. Uh, since we're dealing with soldiers, I'm gonna use gren primarily grenades and... Okay, we can't go up there. Primarily grenades and other means. Why would you do that? You know what? Fuck you. He's retarded. So I guess now you get to see what happens. And some somehow on the inside I feel empty. This guy needs a backstory. Um, he was... He had his crossbow and he thought he could 5v1 headcrabs and he lost. The fuck is this? What the fuck? Hello. Aww. Oh, these things are adorable. You should- you should- you should totally look at this. Like- like the idle animations for this shit. If I don't have to switch weapons. I have to switch weapons. Let's go back to that thing. It's gonna be our default, our, our default guy. So this brings us right back here. Occasionally Gordon touches it. Look at this, look. Oh, 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 oh. It's adorable. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll use it here. Ah, uh, some science here. Oh, well, I'm not going to destroy those quite yet. <laughs> I think it hates me. Uh, okay, so there's something to that. But there's something I'm supposed to do here. Just to press something. I, I would have figured it would be up here. Maybe I should just jump to that. Let's try and do that. Oh no. Yeah, let's just destroy it. Be free. Let's just let them fight each other. These guys are fucking dicks. You know what? I'm returning fire. Those were not easy, but whatever. Alright. Explosives. Trying to destroy these. Thank you. And there's literally nothing there, it's pointless. The fuck does this machinery, like, what, what purpose does this machinery serve? It has spiky edges on it. Ah, uh, there is a mine over there. That son of a bitch. 
I, I knew there'd be a trap in here. They know I can't resist crates. Well. Ah! Why? Why do we hold these in cages? Okay, I think we're good. Uh, let's see what's down here first. Well, oh, down here there's a- uh, oh, this brings us right back over here. Well, we don't- we don't need to go there yet. We, we, we should not stray off the linear path that the game has set for us. Well, you know, let's kind of see who wins there. Let's even the odds a little bit. Or not. Because they're retarded. You know, I killed these guys with crowbars. What do you guys do? Oh, he did his little, like, little tailspin attack. And there's another one apparently right there. What? Why are you shooting at me, you motherfucker? There's only one thing that they hate more than each other, and that's me. Huh. Okay. Oh, there's some science to be done here, too. Oh, shit! Lasers! I'm not touching that. That- that just sounds like it's gonna fucking kill me. Some kind of weapon? Put that down. It's a prototype. Man, they're amazing it. It's much too unpredictable. Don't let it overcharge. What, what do you mean, overcharge? <laughs> And now we have a, a new weapon here. And more lasers. Naturally more lasers. Every fucking time it's lasers. Alright, we're gonna use this thing a little bit. Now, this is actually used often in speedruns to accelerate you. Because it actually pushes you back. I'll, I'll... When I get the opportunity to show it off, I'll do it. Like, it's, it just pushed me back there majorly. So naturally, when people are like bunny hopping through the through the levels, I can't really do it. By the way, I'm oh, sorry, but you could use you could use a charge up blast to basically make you go, yourself go faster. I don't know if I can bunny hop here at all in this game. I think you have to enable it somehow, or there's some trick to it. Okay, I'm not very good at it, so maybe they fixed it or something. Alright, all the lasers appear to be on now. Let me just make sure I got everything here. Yep, okay. So the lasers are all going into this room right here. So it's like, uh, do not obstruct laser shield. So let's just try it out like this. So, uh, we're gonna laser some shit. Yay! Well, we can't really make it out there. Okay, well, that's, uh, how it is. But that, basically, that thing is a tip on how to beat this. Basically, we win this by uh, obstructing the laser shield, as you would expect. Oh boy, oh boy. A really cool laser thing. All right, well, uh, and just hop down here. Oh, that's it for that. 
Fuck laser shields and everything about them. A scientist. Thank God. Get us out of here before those military drones figure out where we're hiding. We all have retinal scanner access. Escort us to the lobby and we can get out of the lab. You'll have to shut down the surgical unit first. Peter switched it on, but I'm afraid he never made it back. A surgical unit, really? Cool. Lead the way. All right. Well, just follow me then. You are going to have to leave me here, Gordon. All right. Fuck. I think they just don't. There you go. They're just a little bit upset at the fact that I I, I can't uh, can open the door by chance. Or oh, I can do that. All right, follow me. See all the work I've done, all my handiwork. Yeah, I'm pretty proud of myself. You gotta get me out here. I'm sick of Black Mesa. Well, I'll let you out, but I'm warning you, it's hell out there. It's completely under military control. You'll have to sneak and fight your way from one end to the other, and I don't expect you'll meet many of our peers along the way. But if you do survive and somehow make it across the base, you'll end up at the Lambda Complex, where the rest of the science team has taken shelter. I wouldn't venture there myself, but I will let them know that you are coming. Uh, yeah, let's see where he goes. I'm curious. Oh, uh, that's it? That's all you did? Oh, he goes around the corner. He's just embarrassed. He's a little bit shy. He's like, oh, it's the great Gordon Freeman. Alright. Let's go out the rotating door. Oh, you had- you killed a bunch of scientists here. Got them all. Okay, we're good. I was sure we didn't have them all. Oh, now we're kind of uh, on the outside of Black Mesa. This is kind of nice. Just kind of being careful here. Oh, that's nice. We got we got a good amount of ammo. Well, this is uh, surface for, surface tension for you. I could have just blown up the shit behind them, but that's fine. Alright, I think I'm gonna cut it off here, so uh, next time we'll uh, continue with the uh, surface tension here, so take care everybody. Oh, I can go back!